Let us look at the second way to get the integral of square root sec x to the power 5 divided by square root sine x to the power 3 dx. Let us write, uh, let us multiply top and bottom with sec x cubed to the power half, i.e. square root of sec x cubed. Upstairs and downstairs, and then everything here is the same, except we write this as sec x to the power 5 to the power of half, and similarly downstairs, sine x cubed to the power of half. Power half means square root, okay? Now let us combine this. The power is the same, so you can put power out here, and then you multiply uh, sec cube x times sec x to the power 5, where you can add the exponent, which is 8. So it'll be sec x to the power 8 to the power half. Downstairs, we do the same. Uh, put this in a common uh, square root, so you get sec x cubed times sine x cubed to the power half. Notice that from the property of exponentiation, you can cancel that, you get 4 here. So you get sec x to the power 4 dx, then downstairs uh, sine cube x times sec cube x is tangent x cubed to the power half. Now you can peel off a sec square x from here, and then you're left with sec square x, and then downstairs is the same. Now we can push this into dx, the root of tangent x is sec square x dx, and then write this as 1 plus tangent square x, and then this piece is here. Now there are two pieces, one piece is 1 over this, second piece is tangent square x over that, d tangent x. This is nothing more than tangent x, you can multiply that, you get 3 over 2, because it's 1 over, you get negative 3 over 2, so the integral is negative 3 over 2 plus 1 over the same thing downstairs. Here you have tangent x to the power 2 and multiply that you get tangent x to the power 3 over 2 since the base is the same you can have 2 minus 3 over 2 because you get an integral you need to add 1 here and then write the same thing of the exponent down here 1 is 2 over 2 minus 3 plus 2 is minus 1 over 2 minus 1 over 2 here and minus 1 over 2 here flip it up you get negative 2 here 2 plus 1 uh, uh, this and that you get negative half 2 minus half is 3 over 2, 3 over 2 exponent, 3 over 2 downstairs, flip it out with 2 third. Right here it says minus 2, and tangent to the power of negative half is square root tangent x, and here will be 2 third in front, and then square root is 1 over 2, and then inside is tangent x cubed plus c. Done. Thank you for watching. Hope video is informative, helpful. Before you go, make sure you subscribe, share, comment, and don't forget to hit or smash the like button. See you.